Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if the Windows print queue is stuck and it doesn't appear that anything is printing out of your printer. So this should be a pretty quick tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. And we're going to start by opening up the star menu and you want to type in printer. Best match should say printer and scanner. You want to open that up underneath system settings. And now Windows 7 and Windows 8, it's going to look a little bit different, but the concept is going to be the same. You want to locate your printer. On Windows 7 and Windows 8, you probably would just right click on and then select properties or open queue, so which is what we're going to do right here on Windows 10. Now at the top left, you want to select the printer tab and then select cancel all documents. You're going to be prompted, are you sure you want to cancel all documents? Select yes. Once you've done that, you can close out of these windows and I would recommend opening up the star menu. Type in command prompt. Best match should say command prompt right above desktop app. You want to right click on that and then select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control window you want to select yes. Now into this elevated command line window you want to type in net net space stop another space spooler Keep in mind there's two O's in spooler and there's a space in between the net as well as in between the stop and the spooler. So net, stop, spooler, exactly how it appears on my screen. Then you're going to hit enter. should say the print spooler service is stopping and then once it has stopped successfully, now you want to copy in the description of the video this command. So I'm just going to copy right out of my notepad file here. And up at the top bar of the command prompt, you want to right click, left click on edit, and then left click on paste. Once you pasted that in, you want to hit enter on your keyboard. Just be patient, this will take a second, and then once you have a blinking cursor, you can close out of the command prompt window. And now I'd recommend you open up the star menu again, and type in services. Best match should say services right above desktop app. You want to left click on that, and now you want to go down to find print spooler, right here, and you want to double click on that and you want to set startup type to automatic and then you want to click the start button if service status says stop. Once you're done doing that you want to click on apply and OK. At this point I recommend closing out of any open programs or windows you have on your computer. Restart your computer as well as your printer and hopefully your problem has been resolved. So as always thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I hope I helped you out and I look forward to catching you all in the next video. Goodbye.